Crime is also on the rise at USM and campus police seek your help in stopping it. Reporter Brittany Payne has the story. With almost 40 reported offenses since the semester began, the University of Southern Mississippi averages an illegal crime every two days. Lee Johnson, a former employee of the Payne Center, says the workout building is one of the most popular places for campus thieves to strike. Got cell phones, stolen wallets. They got lockers at the bottom, but uh, those things have been pointed out numerous of times. It's uh, it's definitely a bad place to uh, be leaving your stuff around. Petty larceny, mainly bicycle theft, is the number one crime on campus. Keeping her bike safe three years straight, resident assistant Jennifer Sansine has bike protection down to a science. According to Sansine, it's all in the lock. I did a lot of research on my lock before I got it, so make sure nobody can cut it or break it in my code. The wiring is not too thin, it's made out of Kevlar, and the numbers, there's a million different codes that your numbers could be. This bike right here, this wire, this is really easy to cut through because it's a lot smaller and it's also a key lock so you can pull it through. Time is made is a lot thicker. If bikes are not secured, thieves will even take wheels and bike seats. USM Police Chief Bob Hopkins declined an on-camera interview but says most on-campus thefts are crimes of opportunity. Hopkins urges students to keep their doors locked, windows rolled, and bikes chained. Reporting for Up City TV, Brittany Payne.